Hello, good morning, and welcome to a, a new episode. I'm Richard, that's Carol, and we've got two guests with us today, two guests from down south. And Saddlebag73 may know this guy behind me. Do you want to introduce yourselves? Big one, the ladies first. Kim. Yeah, and what's your channel, Kim? Uh, my channel is Sid and Kim's Two Wheel Adventures. So have a look. And this is Sid. And this, this is Sydney. This yeah. is Sydney. I'll take you a walk around Sydney. <laughs> How old Sydney? Oh, wow. like seven years old now, I think. Seven. And if you look on uh, Kim's channel, she took it all the way round Spain. And uh, it's done some miles now. How many miles has it done? It's like 37. 37. Uh, and you've had it from new? 27, isn't it? Yeah, 27. <laughs> <laughs> We'll yeah, say he's done a few thousand. miles. 19,000? 19. Yeah. Okay. What did I say? 37? Yeah. <laughs> 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 uh, uh, that's, that's more of me. Yeah. yeah. Well, you've got some miles on your uh, uh, GS, haven't you? I you... uh, just clipped 30,000 now. 30,000, yeah. And that's the 1,200, isn't it? It's yeah, it's 1,200 without seat. 2013. Yeah. She's looking all right still. Yep. And if you want to have a look, his channel's called Boxed Out Adventurer. There's quite a bit of Spain on there, isn't there? If you want to take Spain, a look. Um, trying to do some stuff for the TL, but yeah, yeah. And if you look back on my channel, I'll put a link up this side or up this side about his TL, which I uh, was lucky enough to have a go on. And uh, he's got uh, lots more on his channel about that TL. The plan today is we're just going to have a nice ride round. We're going to show these two the delights of the Peak District. And we're going to go and have breakfast at Matlock Bath. Cool. Kim's bike's loud. Mm. She's got a new exhaust on that, hasn't she now? She has got a new exhaust. You okay, two ready? ready? Yeah, we're ready. Low clouds clearing for us just in time, yeah, Carol. It is, yeah, it's been, been really nice misty on the way up. In another hour or so. Yeah. How far out of Matlock Bath do you think we are? About 10 miles. I think they're both recording for their own channels as well, aren't they? Yeah. This is our first ride out since I had to get new tyres on my bike. Yeah. From our little mishap on Glencoe. Unfortunate, but Carol rescued me, didn't you? I did. I had to drive the van. Very I've kind of you. Van before. <laughs> Our plan to to do a nice ride out with our friends is to go up over. Is it Snake Pass? Snake Pass, yes. Snake Pass, I think. Which we have shown you several times before, so I don't know whether we'll film Probably that. But we'll show that. No, nah, but we are going for breakfast at Matlock Bath. Not Matlock. Matlock Bath. We have actually ridden with these guys a few times. There's a few videos uh, uh, in the uh, back catalogue where we've been riding with them. Some of them down in Cornwall. And there's uh, there's one in the Picos. We met them. We rode down south, didn't we? From our base in uh, Potes. And we went down to meet them. They were on their way back to the ferry. So we, we headed down south, didn't we? On a really, really wet, horrible day in Spain. God, we were soaked and frozen, weren't we? <laughs> Got down to uh, the nice hotel that they were staying in from our little uh, cabin. It was quite a nice, a quite nice, a nice night out, wasn't it? Compared, yeah, it yeah. was, yeah. God, this road is awful. It is, isn't it? It's it's covered in lime. Crap on the road. This is all coming from, uh, from the quarry. Taking you down on the famous, is it Via Gela or Via Gelia or Via Gelia? Come on, locals, tell me how to pronounce it. Via Gelia, I think.
Arkwright's doors straight across the road. Oh, a nice place, Comford. Mm. Oh. Cyberman over there. Sorry? Cyberman on the left. Who? Cyberman. Oh yeah, there is a Cyberman, yeah. I don't think he's actually there, is he? I think it's a Cyberman suit. Yeah. Shop's called Collector's Corner. That's interesting. So, interesting it's collection. Like, I think. You now know where to get your Cyberman suit. <laughs> it's Cromford. Yeah. a round of eating when you have friends round. <laughs> Take out last night. Going out for a <laughs> which minute. was all right, wasn't it? it was we've just we've just discovered this app called Just Eat, which <laughs> yeah. I think everybody else in the world is aware of. But, yeah. <laughs> but we're all fogies and never, never used it before, have we? Yeah, that's yeah, quite a revelation. It was a revelation. This man turned <laughs> up with a load of food, unbelievably. <laughs> yeah. Oh dear. So yes, we're out tonight as well. And we're eating out for breakfast. No wonder with the size we are. I know, it's not helping our diet, is it? It's not. Oh, well. It's uh, really nice that they've made the effort to come up and see us. Really appreciate it. Yeah, it's been a good laugh. Yeah. Me and Heath go back a long way, actually. I uh, first met Heath a decade ago when we were both doing our first tour out to the Alps. And Heath was on a... A Ducati monster with a huge, got a huge rucksack on his back. And we had a good laugh actually, we had a real good laugh. There's a space here, I think there's enough space here, isn't there? Yeah. Just in next to that uh, cross tour. I don't think Costas is open. Pun? don't think Costas is open. Is he not? No. I'm sure. What's happened to Costas? No. <laughs> Cheat! That's cheating! <laughs> That's cheating! <laughs> I've seen some things. <laughs> Right guys, we're going to go and have breakfast, so it doesn't look like we're having breakfast at Costas, so we'll have to find somewhere else. So did you enjoy Via Jello, which is the uh, rundown? Lovely. It's good, wasn't it? Yeah. So it's lovely. The trouble is, well, we're thinking of breakfast, it doesn't look open. So we might have to adjust plans yet. 